It means Raga and I, we never just. Never enough! <laughs> okay. Oh, never, Please never, stop. Never, never enough! Morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Friday Tonight then. It's the end of the week, which means the beginning of the weekend. And the kids are so excited because I told them yesterday, every single time we drive to school, we drive past this one place that we always want every single day. What is it, guys? Donuts. Very excited. Donuts for Friday morning breakfast. Now, I know in the past, you had a Saturday morning donut tradition. Yeah. That was a long time ago, and it's been a while since we've done it. But now we've got a donut shop kind of nearby, and it's on the way to school. So if we made it a Friday tradition, it's something that I think we maybe could do every Friday. Do you think? Could this be the beginning of a new donut tradition in the Bingham family? I think it yeah. could be. I think it could actually be. Braxton's rocking a giant gold chain today. I'm rocking a <laughs> His teacher or somebody made him at school yesterday and he came home with a collection of them. He's got yeah. quite a few here. Today, you guys, we gotta get ourselves ready. We gotta get some hair done. We gotta brush our teeth. But what we don't have to do is eat breakfast because like mom said, we're That's getting exciting. out on the way to school, okay? Yeah! Donut Friday. Here we come. Love you, bye. Love you, bye. The kids are off for a Donut Friday. Maybe mom will bring me one back. Glow to be part of this tradition too. We have got a phone call, Zoom call going down with Disney this morning, highlighting all of the events that are gonna be happening in our Disney 100 celebration next week that we've been invited to. So I am so excited to hear all that's gonna be part of that. We'll share any details that we can with you guys. But that's going down here in about an hour. So I'm gonna freshen up, get myself a little bit more ready than normal to start off the day. Head downstairs, get ready for that call, get editing the vlog. Kids are off to school on a Friday. We've got some very fun plans Tonight, we're gonna turn our home into a megaplex. We're having some friends over, fun dinner, and a movie in the theater. We're gonna be doing The Greatest Showman. It should be a ton of fun. The handful of other things going on this morning, lots to do. Kicking off this weekend with a bang. Donuts to start, Disney magic in the middle, Greatest Showman to finish. This is gonna be a great Friday. shoot anything here in this office and it is a spectacular office by the way this chair super super old chair phenomenal chair got it for Christmas I believe but the new one is almost complete and is supposed to be coming in the next week or less so that's exciting but none of that matters I just realized I never really pick up the camera and talk in this office and it's a phenomenal office that deserves to be showcased so I'm gonna let you guys know as I'm sitting standing I should say in here was previously just sitting right there just got off the call with Disney very very exciting stuff coming up you guys but one thing that I did find out is that I can't share anything with you because I wasn't even supposed to tell you yet so that's gonna have to be our little secret. Yeah, I'm supposed to tell you guys next week about it. So when we tell you next week, pretend you haven't heard anything about it. On Monday, just be like so surprised when we surprise you guys with our epic Disney trip coming up. Let me just tell you, there are going to be some next level exciting things like once in a lifetime, just money can't buy Disney magic level of experiences that we cannot wait to share with you guys. Stuff that would not even be possible if it weren't for them bringing us out to do this, to be part of this. Again, I've already said too much. You're not supposed to know yet. I'll tell you more about that next week. But for now, getting the house tidied up. Got some friends coming over tonight. And I do believe one of our most anticipated Christmas gifts of the entire Christmas season has yet to come. We are now a month after Christmas almost, and Santa's sleigh is on a little bit of a delay, but I do believe the delivery is happening today. <laughs> So while we anxiously await and anticipate the arrival of Santa's epic Christmas gift that got left on the sleigh, we are getting ready to slay the night tonight, wow. slaying Friday night. That was pretty awesome. With a freaking fantastic pasta bar to go along with some greatest showman sing-along. Now, technically, it's not the sing-along, but if you but turn on close captions, we're gonna sing, so it could be the sing-along. But we're doing a full-blown pasta bar and movie tonight here in the house. We've invited the Ravelli family over. We're gonna have a full-spread dinner, and then we're gonna watch Greatest Showman. This the mom. Is the great this is the no, greatest show. No. This is how we bring them. Yeah, we, we are currently whipping up some garlic sauce. What are you making here, Mom? This is a homemade Alfredo. Really? The recipe is on the blog. This is HowieBingham.com. Well, Check it out. It's well, like the well. easiest thing ever. It is, and it's fantastic. And it tastes as good Very as Olive Garden. Good. Oh my gosh, how dare you? How dare you? This one is actually the next thing you're telling me is skinny. Just kidding. Oh. I don't make the skinny version. It's full fat milk and cream cheese. You can make wow. it skinny. I just don't. Well, that's how you know it's good. So we got the Alfredo going there. In fact, it's quite the scene here, guys. We got some Alfredo-ness. Oh, it is skinny right there. You 
front line. Yeah, Play skinny. Line, really. Yeah. And then over here we have some fake artichokes and a bunch of Barbie. So we're gonna have to clear that off. Turn this into a. I just told Hazel that pasta and she disappeared. Bar. So what do you think, Mom? Set up all the foods here. People come yeah. up and get it. How do you want to yeah, do this? Yeah, we're gonna do oh, bow tie and tie. thin spaghetti. Oh my gosh, two of my favorites right there. You Elbows? Know. No. Well, I was contemplating it, but I think we're just gonna do two. And you know what? Those pastas. are the two best. I mean, those are those are really they really, really are. Best. Best. So bow tie, thin spaghetti for tonight. Stephanie on the garlic bread, and then desserts. Mom, is anyone on dessert? Are we just doing like a free? You know what? That's like the, the one theater. thing we didn't plan was a dessert. That seems very unlike all of us. Just drop that in there. <laughs> But we have tons of movie theater candy. Okay, so concessions candy. I just came home with a few bags of Oreos oh. and chips ahoy. Hazy girl, would you mind cleaning up your Barbie so we can fill this island with pasta? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Yes. Such a sweet little princess, and I love you. I love you. And how's your day going today on a Friday? Good. Good. It's Friday day. It's Saturday, Saturday Sunday, Sunday, what? We're going on a Dishwalk. Hazel Bingham, did you clean your room up entirely today? Mm -hmm. This looks incredible, and you still have the H, sort of. There's a one extra bin. Mm -hmm. Hazy, this looks amazing. You did such a good job. Thank you. Do you want to tell everyone the truth? Yeah, my mom actually cleaned it this morning. <laughs> That's okay, because you thought about it, you thought about it. Yeah. It looks incredible, and we've always said a million times, I love that your room's trash, because it means you use it, you have fun in it, you have a great imagination, you play with your dolls, you do make believe, you draw, you craft, and guess what? That's what this room is for. So for I can't wait me. for the next mess. Okay, should we go downstairs? I think I just heard people at the door. Yeah. Ooh, that's cool. Ooh, that's cool. Pasta. How was it, everybody? Pasta good? So, so, so good. good. Micah, did you like it? Bussin. Thank you. <laughs> Bussin. That's how you know it's good. Now, we're getting ready to make an entire cup of candy. That's dessert tonight. We just laid out all the candies on one yeah. row here. So we took all the jars down, made it really easy and accessible for the kids to get. I'm going gummy bears. And we are getting ready to start the greatest show. Oh, this is going to be the greatest show and the greatest see? night for the greatest yeah. Friday ever. We're not good Singers, oh, we'll try. neither are we, so we'll <laughs> really? just turn it up really loud. Oh, yeah. Shower. Okay, yeah, she is. <laughs> yeah, she's actually a phenomenal singer. <laughs> Whoa. Dude, that is shaking the wall. This is the menu, dude. <laughs> no, this is pretty loud. <laughs> The greatest show, the greatest showman, the greatest friends, and the greatest leader. Okay, here we go. Aww. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Oh, I'm gold. I need to grab a blind trap here. Uh, I want to see you. Sorry, he's too loud. That's so cool. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gents, this is the moment you've waited for. <laughs> wrapped up the greatest show men <laughs> I will say this though, that was one of the greatest times we've watched it. We saw it in theaters multiple times, we've seen it in a home multiple times, seeing it in our home theater. My bum was shaking on those <laughs> no, chairs. Wow, all right, that's TMI. But the bass was thumping, the legs so were cool. jiggling. <laughs> <laughs> My nose jiggled. That was incredible. Yeah. I mean, that was like worth the price cool. of admission. That was an insane. Oh, we forgot to charge them the Oh my gosh, price. how are we supposed to Should pay for her? this? I'll send her a Venmo. Yeah, send her a little uh, invoice <laughs> for that one. But we're charging $100 a head per ticket. Guys, that was super fun. Now the cleanup process begins, but not too bad. Because oh, first yeah. of all, Revellers are awesome, so they help clean up before they take off. They're always so kind and, and I just took a back. picture. I'll, in fact, I'll go get some video to prove it. I took a picture and sent it to them. And I said, this is the cleanest the theater's ever been after a movie watching. Even when it's just us. And I thank them for putting up with my ridiculous theater rules. Because mom yep. will attest, I have some of the craziest, wildest, most unfun rules you can imagine. For a fun guy like me, who's living a fun life, doing some fun stuff. I got a lot of rules when it comes to the theater. I've definitely <laughs> swapped roles in this house. I used to be like the freak. You're like the fun one. Clean. We go around cleaning stuff up. And I'm like, guys, who is this? this Mess cannot be like this. And Mindy's like, relax, just enjoy. And I'm like, who are you? Who am I? <laughs> what has happened? 
<laughs> what is going on here? Thankfully, Ravelli's, they get it, they helped, they cleaned up, it looks incredible. But right now, kids are supposed to be somewhat getting into bed. It is a weekend, it is a Friday. You might hear, probably not though, because we've got the sliding doors closed, so you probably can't hear it too well. But after the greatest showman, kids have been inspired to practice their piano. They're getting well, out. Because when they were doing, what song was it? Come Alive? No, was it uh, Love One? Never Enough? No. Oh, From Now On? Zendaya and. Oh, yeah. What is that? Anyway. The trapeze one that I don't know. Said, you guys, this would sound so cool on a piano. We have the greatest showman piano book, so I noticed Crew snuck out really quick and then I heard the piano and I was like, He came up here to try out some of the stuff, so he's actually playing yeah. Pirates of the Caribbean right now. Kind of fun when you're watching like a musical, it inspires any bit of musical ability you have within mm -hmm. you. It means Raga and I, we just. Never enough! <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Never, Please never, stop. Never and I can't tell if the video is out of focus or if the audio is out of tune. You said something when you fell. have any musical. So that's why I was saying, talent. Ryler and I, and clearly you, not moved or inspired yeah, to do anything no, musical after that. No. Ever. Again. Ever enough. <laughs> Ever. Never. Never yeah. enough. <laughs> he looks back. Found something that should not be in here. Talked about, or at least I did at the beginning of today's video. In fact, I think you even brought it up yesterday. Just thought it might happen yesterday. We have a very important and highly anticipated Christmas gift coming. Apparently, just like the Polar Express bell, it was left on Santa's sleigh, maybe fell <laughs> through a very large pocket out of Santa's sack. I don't know what happened, but basically got left behind. So the anticipated arrival date for Santa's reindeer and his elves said that it was coming today by 10 p.m. I got news Shit. for you. It's 10 p.m., guys, and it is not here. So I have a feeling any moment now, Santa Radar is going to update and say, by the way, this is Amazon, not Santa, and say, funny, it looks like your package is a delayed again. So I don't know. I feel like we should just tell you what it is because this is going to be a real letdown when you finally see what it is. But we were very, very excited to get our very own first ever pizza, pizza oven. oven. <laughs> so it was a wood fire pizza oven. And it's cool. Mana Jo hooked us up with a mad Amazon credit to get a pizza oven. She said, you must buy one of those insane pizza ovens and invite me over for dinner. So we said, we'll do it. Absolutely. <laughs> and we tried one. We went to the neighbor's house. Had, they had us over for dinner. It was insane. We got their exact same one. We loved it so much. The pizzas turned out flawless. Absolutely the best pizza I've ever so had. Nothing will compare. Good. We're excited to do that at some point. Cook our own wood fire, wood burn pizza, whatever you call it. But we just need that pizza oven to come. Yeah, it was kind of weird because we ordered it through Amazon. It took two weeks to ship. Amazon Prime. Like we're talking like, you know, next day, same day, two days. It's really delayed. I know. And then it shipped today. And no, it's... it shipped a while oh, ago, didn't it? It shipped yesterday. And got... then it arrived in Salt Lake City at midnight. So it's been sitting it in Salt Lake City all day. Came from Salt Lake City. So it went to a different sorting facility. Oh my gosh. Ooh, and Nooney, what are you doing? Where are you at? You're so good at this. What uh, happened? Anyways, Maybe we they're are, recharging the new electrical trucks. We are waiting. Not so patiently. I mean, we're doing okay. We couldn't have used it uh, tonight anyway. I've checked the door like a hundred times Yeah, today. literally like a hundred times. But it'll come eventually and then we'll be so excited to receive our most highly anticipated Christmas gift of yeah, Christmas. We'll in show you guys how it all works. Everything. It's, it's a, awesome. Just watching that flame bit, come up over the top. There's and, a little bit of an art to it though. Yeah, there is. And there's a learning curve. So we'll probably burn a bunch of pizzas to start and then we'll eventually figure it out. Yeah, right? I, I think so for yeah. sure. I can do that though. We can figure that out. I'll eat bird pizza all day. We're expecting it sometime soon, and we've got to start packing for their amazing Hopefully vacation tomorrow. coming up. Come back. It's going to be awesome. We love you so much. We'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. And Santa's sleigh is on a little bit of a delay, but I do believe the delivery is happening today. <laughs> Means Rye Guy and I, we just. Never enough! <laughs> okay. Never, 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 and never enough! I, I can't tell if the video is out of focus or if the audio is out of tune. Enough! Never, 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 never enough! enough.